I wanted to do one more video about the 94 through 97 Saturn alternator on a T-Series engine. Uh, this is my extra garage engine. Uh, as this is the Saturn alternator. Um, as you can see, it is bolted up to the factory alternator mount right here with that 3 8 or 10 millimeter bolt. Um, fits in really smooth. This is the stock size fan pulley alternator belt, um, but I remembered when I mocked this up, I think I got a belt which was just one size bigger than this because that worked a little better on my car. The only thing I didn't mention in my previous videos relates to this upper alternator bracket right here. Um, for the Corolla alternator, I think it mounts to this stud just below the water pump. In order to make it work with the Saturn alternator, you have to lower it um, so it mounts to this little bolt um, that holds on the timing cover. And then I'm not sure if this shows, but you actually, I haven't done it to this one, you have to grind the underside of this bracket just a little bit in here in order to make it so a through bolt for the tensioner can actually go through and work. Um, you don't have to do much and it doesn't take long. I did it on mine with a belt sander in about 5 or 10 minutes at most. Um, so you do that. Bonus points if you then repaint your bracket, make it look nice and pretty. But then at that point, you know, as we discussed, pigtail, hook it up to your factory harness how you need. Um, ground nub, you can... I conveniently went to the engine mount bolt right there. Um, charge port, that's the fat 8 gauge wire you need to send to your battery. Um, only other thing to mention is that to get, to get this to work right up here, when you first get this alternator, you do have to take it apart by undoing the three, there's one there, one back there, and another on the bottom here. Undo those three bolts which hold the cases together. And then you just have to rotate. You have to rotate one direction and put everything back together. Because if you don't do that, um, then this tensioner hole is way over here where it's worthless. Um, but that's it. That's all. Happy wrenching, everybody.